So the special events um, today was to recognise the schools who participated in environmental actions such as moth, the moth plant competition and also with waste management. So those are the schools that work together um, in order to make Howick more sustainable. Hello, so my name is Elaine Huang and I am from Botany Down Secondary College. Uh, so Pest Free Howick is an organisation which aims to eliminate pests in the area in order to preserve the natural native um, fauna and flora in the local area. So the mob plant composition was just me and a group of friends going, coming together and we going around Auckland to collect mob plants which are harmful to the environment. And that's just something that we decided to do as a contribution to our community. So for each mob plant, there's around 700 seeds. So for every um, pot eliminated, you essentially eliminate 700 seeds from germinating. The highlight from today was actually presenting to everyone, realizing that there's quite a lot of young um, students around the area and local youth are really interested in environmental action. So that's just something to look forward to in the future as well. Seeing what everyone can do and what everyone can bring. So I think one really important part for the Howick area is for people to become more aware of what's going on in the environment. A lot of the times you think environmental action is something big picture, but at the same time it's also something that can be on, done on a local scale. So perhaps my future aspirations is just for people to come together and focus on a local project collectively. The Howick Local Board is very interested in conservation and we understand the value of eliminating pest plant species from the local area as well as our animal pest species. Local board has supported the Pest Free Howick program for a number of years now and uh, we take great pride in doing so and it's wonderful to see all the schools that are involved and the enthusiasm. The sooner we get young people involved in working out ways they can help control pest species, be they plant or animal, uh, the better it's going to be for long, in the long run for New Zealand's flora and fauna. And the more of these that we can save, uh, the better it's going to be for our country and for following generations to enjoy 